Hi there. This is Al from TheGamingGeek.net and we've got another performance test for you today. So there you go. Uh, that was Josie Marin uh, who plays a character in this game. This game is called Need for Speed Most Wanted. Uh, I think this was released on the PlayStation 2 and the Nintendo GameCube. We're playing the PlayStation 2 version. And I'm not sure if I mentioned the device already, but this is the Red Thread Pocket 3 Plus. And this game was a request by one of the channel subscribers. So here I am obliging. Now we're seeing the game's... Um, opening cinematics and it's playing quite well let me just adjust the lighting real quickly no issues here not on the opening sequence i doubt that there will be any uh, issues by the way i'm using the pal version because that is locked to 50 frames per second or 50 megahertz and we're gonna disable the game soundtrack because I don't I think this game is using copyrighted settings I mean copyrighted music so I'll be back real quick all right we'll back uh, and it's just the game's uh, sound effects this time no music uh, but that's to make sure that uh, I don't get any copyright issues okay so before we begin I'm using default settings for uh, this device so let me just walk you through what that is uh, or my default settings at least so I have Vulkan as the GPU renderer we have accurate for hardware download mode everything's just uh, 1x resolution and then we do have a, a threaded uh, let me just look for it a threaded presentation here uh, that's checked uh, in the advanced settings, everything's default except for software rendering threads. We have it at 5. And for system, we have no underclocking. So cycle rate is at 100%. And cycle skip is at normal. Right? So let's take a look at what that looks like by doing a quick race. Uh, let's random over oh, there. I wanted a green car, so. Checking the controls, nitrous e-brake. All right. There you go, first performance issues of the, the game. We are now at 50% uh, game speed. There you go. So this is how it plays on default. Definitely slow. Alright, I just wanted you guys to see how bad it is at default. So that you can appreciate the improvements once we make some tweaks. Um, so it is playable at this uh, pace. I think now it's at 70% uh, game speed. But of course, uh, playing it at this rate is um, not uh, aligned to the game's title, which is Need for Speed. So we want things to be a little faster, right? So I'm going to press Start here, and we're going to make uh, the changes. So I've already tested this out. We're not going to um, take it step by step. Uh, the It's at... It works well at 60% cycle rate and moderate for cycle skip. So let's take a look at the, what happens. Immediately we get a change. We jump to 90% to 100% game speed. Although it does feel choppy. I don't know if it's uh, reflecting in the recording. But I can definitely feel the frame skipping right 
It's not bad, it's still playable, but it... You can definitely want for more. Ooh. Man, I'm really not good at driving games. Alright, hopefully we still win this game match. Alright, so we're gonna play this at the, these settings uh, for a few more tracks. As many tracks that I can win in. Right, because I've been playing this uh, before recording this episode and you know, I'm just bad at racing games. It takes me a while to pick pick the mechanics up and start winning and oh no especially turning here I haven't gotten a good feel of turns uh, in this uh, game I keep like over drifting or something and uh, start hitting the walls and all that you seen you saw what happened right when the turn is too tight I can sometimes ram into a wall there you go I don't I, I don't have a good feel of how it is to turn in this game yet I don't even know if I can still catch up. It's also harder to play while uh, recording because I can't put the the device up to my face, right? Or uh, I have to play it uh, outstretched. So uh, we'll exit and we'll go into career mode. Career. We'll do start new career. New alias, it says. Oh no. I'm gonna mute that. I'm not sure what happened, why it loaded uh, freaking music. Uh, wait a second. All right, we have to settle for no music because I might get uh, copyright issues. You know what? I'll, I'll uh, restart one second. All right, I'm back. And we are starting a career. Let's see how far I can get because again I'm not pretty bad at this really. And it doesn't help that I have to play it uh, with outstretched arms. So far so good, that ran well. This is a little staticky but I think that's how it's supposed to be. A little choppy but running at 100%, just a few dips here and there. Now uh, this game, 
has gotten me curious enough that I'm planning to play this on the AYN Odin Pro. So stay tuned for that episode, uh, which is uh, coming out next week. But yeah, there's a frame rate dip there. But. Oh no! He's way ahead of me now. So such a teaser, right? This is the real start of the race, by the way. Of the of career. Quite dramatic for a racing game. What an ass, all right. You know what, let's give the cinematics because we know it's running well. All right, let me just focus on winning this race because I've never won it. I've tried several times before recording this episode. I've never won it. So far, so good. I'm paying attention to the street signs. Oh no. 
There's my problem. I think he got... Oh my goodness. That's my problem here. I keep... Oh man. We're, let's restart. And that's not a problem with the game. It's really... I can't... I'm not used to the... The turning mechanics yet. So one more try. I thought I was doing really well. And then just one sharp turn and you know. I hit the wall. I had that problem there earlier. Oh no. Oh no. Man, the room for error here is really small I thought I did well but it looks like I'm gonna lose man that was like freaking all right that's of the turning mechanics so I run into walls when when I turn too much, I guess that's the term. Let's get some distance between us. Oh, look at that. So far so good, one bad turn can get us in trouble though. Ah, uh, he's right behind us, oh no, yeah we're losing it here. Oh no, crud. Man, look at that. That's the margin for error here is really, really small. Sorry, it's that. Uh, now I got stuck. There you go, and I'm last, and it will not let us progress unless I win that race. No other way around it. We can't proceed uh, with career mode. So we'll just do random races. Maybe. What's this challenge series? Now nah, let's just do. Quick races, right? Right, the, the lap knockout cascade, one more circuit. Uh, we have the yellow car. 
Yeah, I don't know why people keep requesting racing games. <laughs> That's clearly not my specialty. All right, but you're not here to watch uh, player win races, right? You're here to watch whether or not uh, a racing game plays well on the O. See that one? I, I missed. I couldn't see the, the track real well. You're here to see whether or not Need for Speed Most Wanted runs decently on the Retroid Pocket 3. And I will tell you, it does. Oh no, I can't. Yeah, there you go. There's just a bit of choppiness to it, but nothing too bad, right? But uh, there, it is enough for me to want to try and see how it plays on the AYN Odin Pro, right? Because uh, I think that we can squeeze better performance and the more powerful device this is what i don't get in this game how i can drift into a turn i don't understand that What's going on? There, see? It's like I, I am getting stuck in the turn. Even though uh, I don't want to turn anymore. I don't think it's an issue with the device though. It's, it's really the game's mechanics. I, I, I'm just not used to the timing and all that of, of uh, turns. So... All right, so far so good. I'm not even sure if I'm using nitro properly, you know. I think I'm doing decent in this track, uh, if I'm not mistaken, I'm first in first place currently uh, against four com against three other competitors, and it's the first lap out of three, so still quite a way to go. Ah, uh, there's a lap one so now we're at uh, lap two i have a almost a second lead over everyone over second place sorry so career could be for someone who's already gotten some practice here in quick races Right now, I see that uh, rock there. All of a sudden, we're second place. Oh. Alright, running really well. Look at the... It's not like there's a lot of graphical compromise. I mean, look at the lighting effects there. Oops, got distracted. Now I'm in second place again. Now I'm overturning again. 
Now I'm in fourth place because you know. Yeah, so when you're racing, uh, you you don't have the luxury of appreciating the the world around you. I made that mistake. I looked into the sun, appreciated the blue sky, and then you know, I lost the lead. I. I thought I regained it, but no. Where are we supposed to go? I'm lost. Freaking insane. Alright, we're not gonna win this uh, race anymore. Let's just finish it. I'm too far behind because I ran into a wall. And uh, at least from experience, when you've already, where you're already behind uh, your opposition by this much, you have no chance of catching up. By the way, this game, oh, look at that, freaking, so hard to see where you're supposed to go. By the way, this game does make the Retroid po Pocket 3 a plus a little warm. So you know it's, um, it's asking for some processing power. See, I thought that was a road. Or I ran into a fence. Man, alright. The fence is blending into the road. Ah, oh, shoot. I don't even know if I'll be able to catch up to third place. I don't think so. I think they're already at the finish line. Yeah, we're 30 seconds behind because I keep running into walls. I'm all out of nitro. And I think we're coming up to the... Oh, I'm second place now. Did you look at that? All right. Oh, shoot. It's funny because I didn't expect it, but you know, I'm in second place. Finish second, all right. Okay, one more quick play, speed trap. We're, we'll avoid circuit, lap knockout. Speed trap, hmm. Wonder how that runs. 
So one last test. Let's just make sure that uh, this game plays well on this device. So now we're playing Speed Trap. I don't know what that does. But it's just two vehicles. Us and one opponent. Oh, that that's this is the part where you know it really gets me because it feels like I'm coming short on the turn, so I keep you know pulling the analog stick. So I'm short, I hit the outer wall, but then because I'm pulling the analog stick, I'm now over my turn, and so I hit the opposite wall uh, head on. And then I get stuck, and, and then I lose, so. Something that I'll need to learn, oh. What just happened? I'm also not sure why there's all of a sudden static. Got another picture. See that? It's a little lonely because first place is already ahead of us for several seconds. Another turn, uh, make it made it out of that one. All right. Oops. I didn't see that. I don't know why it's blinking all of a sudden, but we got to the end, so that's one more race. And you know what? I think we're good. Let's just take a look at what lap knockout is. We'll play the first lap knockout uh, race that we run into, and then we'll call it an episode. All right, and I got a pink car. All right, maybe pink will bring me luck. Oh, this car feels nice. There's the over, the under over that I've been talking about. I don't know why that happened. 
I don't remember turning but my car turned to the right maybe I flicked the switch the stick all right no worries we're in second place the first place car isn't too far ahead of us I think I can see him right now a little nitro and we're right behind him I wonder if this is like asphalt where you can oh oh look at that that's a bad that will get me to fourth place in no time I wonder if this is like asphalt where you can run an opponent into the wall and they would crash Cloud knocked out. Alright, so I think that's what this means. Lap knockout, the last one, last place car gets eliminated. We're in lap two and we're still competitive, which is surprising. Because I've got, I had a lot of bad bumps and a lot of bad turns, but we're in first place, so weird. All right, let's conserve our nitro for when we need it. There, did we just see that? I don't know what happened, and now we're stuck. Yeah, so something uh, that, that if I'm going to play this game, I need to, you know, learn because now it's from first to third place just because of that bad uh, turn. Although third place is very slow, so we've recovered second. And we might even be able to catch up to first place here. I can see him. He's not that far ahead. Man, when the walls look like roads. I will be eliminated. Okay, so yeah. Because of that turn. Alright. Well, this is Need for Speed Most Wanted. I'm going to load another race. Sprint. Uh, this is Need for Speed Most Wanted. Originally released on the PlayStation 2. It runs well on the uh, Retroid Pocket 3 Plus. Well enough. But you need to set your cycle rate to 60% and cycle skip to moderate. Right? Moderate underclock. For you to get 100% game speed uh, in races. And you need to play the PAL road. Which is what I'm doing. right? Because this is locked to 50 frames per second. So I will take a look at this game on the A1 Odin Pro. I, I actually might try the... Oh, look. Freaking... I actually might try the... Uh, NTSC ROM, the US version, and see if that uh, performs better. But I hope you enjoyed uh, this episode. If you have game requests that you want me to try on the Retroid Pocket 3 Plus or any of my other Retro Handle devices, let me know and I'll add your request to the list. Uh, once again, this is Al from TheGamingGeek.net. Talk to you in the next video.